In this video, we'll be looking at diagonals of a rectangular solid. Our problem is to find the length of the diagonal from point B to point H in terms of X, Y, and Z. So point B is right here, and point H is right here. So the diagonal goes from here to here. Now the first thing that we'll want to do is look at the slice uh, going down and use the right triangle that has BH as the hypotenuse, HG as one of the legs, and then BG as the other leg. And that is a right triangle. So in order to find the length of BG, we're going to need to use the base right triangle, which has this as a leg, uh, the one labeled Y, and then this one as a leg, the one labeled X. And that also is a right angle. So if I put like a question mark there, okay, um, I know that the squares of these legs, x and y, added together is going to equal the square of this question mark segment. So let me write that, x squared plus y squared equals question mark squared. And then to get that length of the question mark side, I could, if I wanted to, square root both sides. I have the square root of x squared plus y squared equals question mark. So we'll use that now in this uh, vertical right triangle. I still need this line segment, but we know that it's the same as this one over here, which is Z. So let me label this as Z. So then this uh, vertical one, let me label the diagonal that I'm looking for. I'll call that little d. So now again, the sum of the squares of the legs of this right triangle is equal to the hypotenuse square. So one of the legs is z, the other leg is question mark. So question mark squared plus z squared is equal to little d squared. Okay. Now I don't need to use this uh, in my problem, I can go ahead and come back up here and use question mark squared. And I know that that's equal to x squared plus y squared. So I'll put that in right here for this term. And I can write then x squared plus y squared. And then continue copying plus z squared is equal to little d squared. So finally, then, to get the diagonal length, I can just square root both sides. And I have square root of x squared plus y squared plus z squared is equal to d. So the diagonal uh, from B to H is this measure. 